Colorado State head coach Jay Norvell was asked about Deion Sanders and their upcoming matchup against the Buffaloes, and he did not hold back. Take a look. Boy, there's just a little bit of buzz uh, uh, yeah. on the team that you're playing, and I know Deion Sanders is, is the figurehead of it all. Yeah, I don't really want to talk about him right now. They're tired of all that stuff. They really are tired of it. And I sat down with the ESPN today, and I don't care if they hear it in Boulder. I told them I took my hat off and I took my glasses off, and I said, when I talk to grown-ups, I take my hat and my glasses off. That's what my mother taught me. <laughs> I mean, I'm tired of all that stuff. It's just, it's, it's, and I know everybody else is too. And Deion Sanders fired back exactly how you thought he would. Check it out. Yes, sir. I'm out of my own business watching some film, trying to get ready. Trying to get out of here and be the best coach I could be. And I look up and I read some bull junk that Dan said about us. Talk to us. Once again. Uh, talk to us. Why would you want to talk about us when we don't talk about nobody? All we do is go out here, work our butts off, and do our job on Saturday. But when they give us ammunition, they unmatched Brown and made it what? It was just going to be a good game. And made this shit personal. They done messed around and made it personal. It was going to be a great test, a battle of Colorado, but they done messed around and made it personal. Personal. You know what happened to them last year, the guard? That's Jimmy. Talk to him, Jimmy. Talk to him, Jimmy. Y'all know what happened to the last year. Talk to him, Jimmy. Y'all know what happened to the last year. I've been seeing a lot of people say that this is scripted, but I don't think so. I think Jay Norvell just really doesn't like Deion Sanders. I watched that entire interview, and every time Jay Norvell was asked about Deion Sanders, he was disrespectful, dismissive, and he took a lot of personal shots. He also doesn't like all the attention that comes with Deion Sanders, and I disagree with that. I know people that are watching college football for the first time because of Deion Sanders, and if more people are tuning in to watch Deion, then more people are tuning in to watch your team. So I don't see why this is a bad thing. I understand some people don't like Deion Sanders. They don't like his antics. But the attention he brings is a good thing. And if he's winning football games, then I don't see a problem with it. But maybe I'm wrong. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of Deion Sanders versus Jay Norvell. And don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe for more content just like this. And I will see you in the next upload.